When the much respected man seen as the savior of his country is rushed to the hospital, it's a question of hold the front page. Nelson Mandela was brought to this military hospital in the capital Pretoria for what is being described as a routine visit, tests. Nothing to be alarmed about, the South African government says. But there's no such thing as routine for a 94-year-old man known to be in frail health, and people are worried. I really hope that he gets well soon and uh, is back, back strong again soon. We hope that everything goes well and that um, the tests come out positive. Normally, Mandela spends his time at his home village about 500 miles away. This was him at his 94th birthday celebration last July, when he seemed physically well, if mentally a little detached at the time. But now he's in the hospital again, and a security cordon has been set up. South Africa's current president, Jacob Zuma, who visited Mandela, says he looks well and is getting good care. But the reverence for Mandela here is such that details of his condition are rarely discussed in public. And there have been several recent health scares, a chest infection, abdominal pains, a prostate problem. Each time Nelson Mandela is hospitalized, there's cause for concern. Yet each time so far, he's managed to beat the odds, showing the same kind of resilience he has all his life. And here and around the world, people will be hoping he does it again. Mark Phillips, CBS News, Pretoria.